think my bunnies like the Hololens. Do you guys like the Hololens? Do you guys like hanging out? Look at your little leg. Do you guys like the Hololens? Boop. <laughs> back with another video. Today we're going to be doing Hollow Bowl, which is a bowling app that someone sent me that you can go, uh, you can bowl anyone, set up a lane, do anything. It says it works best in big rooms, so I'm in my big room today, and our big living room, and we're going to be checking it out. I've been pretty excited about this app. Um, it's kind of a cool idea. This is my first time trying it, so let's go ahead and we'll get right into it. We'll figure it all out, and yeah. I don't have a cameraman today, so I'm going to be using the tripod, so it's going to be a little bit of a wider angle than you guys are used to, not really follow me around, but hopefully it'll work. So we'll go ahead and check it out. Let's go ahead and get right into the app. Hollow Bowl is the name. It's basically a pre-release, so it's pretty new. So I'm not going to expect too much out of it. It's pretty new. Made with Unity, just like all apps. Jail Tech, it was a pretty nice fellow, sent me a token for it for free. I think it might be a paid app, I haven't seen though, so I don't know how much it is, but it's a work in progress. Works best in an open space. Okay, well, we are in an open space, so this should be perfect. Okay, go ahead, this will take a sec. We're gonna map our area. It looks like it's gonna go ahead and grab everything. I've already mapped in everything, so. Now this is definitely a pre-release, so so I have to look all around. So I will expect problems. It's a it's a pretty cool idea for an app. Okay, tap to place. Looks like we're good to go. Put that there. Tracking's pretty good. Stick looks like it locks right onto the wall. Stays in place well. Not bad. Seems perfect. Okay, what do we got now? Let's go ahead. and We're gonna start a new game. To have to place some distance away as close to the floor as possible. Okay, some distance away. It's way past the camera angle, but hope we can get a pretty good idea. Okay, we're pretty far away. We're like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, sixteen ish. Feet. Let's just get rough or take these 16 ish feet away from me, which is good because it takes full advantage of. It's going to go ahead and take full advantage of the spatial awareness. I haven't seen too many apps do that. It's been a lot of up close apps, or, you know, sure, you're looking at something far away, but you're never interacting out with something far away. So let's go ahead and we're going to start it. Okay. Strike. I always knew I was a perfect bowler. That's gonna go ahead and cheer me out. I got some confetti flying everywhere across the room. It's kind of cool. Now, Wii Sports Resort is one of my favorite games. So, to have something. Boom. Let's go ahead and we can walk up here and go ahead and look at it. Looks like we got a scoreboard that keeps track of it. Go around it. Looks like we can come up above. Looks like it's an actual back for the TV. It's kind of cool. It's kind of fun. I got another strike. I'm killing it. Didn't even mean to get that one, but I'm killing it. Okay, let's go ahead and we're gonna like stand off to the side. We're gonna go. Woo nope, that was not very good. That's like how I normally bowl. Five pins. Cleans it up. Pretty slick. Works pretty good actually. You got your gutters. Should we see? If we go. Oh, it looks like the gutters actually. Well, that's cool. The gutters actually dip down. You can see the little dot as it goes down. Let's go ahead and shoot a gutter ball. See what happens. Come on. Come on. Ah. Well, we'll try for a gutter one next time. It looks like I'm just that good at bowling. Okay, so it looks like uh, they actually did a really good job of laying it right across the ground. It looks like the gutter just goes down. You can see how that the dot kind of divs around like that. Very cool. A lot of apps actually struggle trying to get it stuck straight to the ground. You know, it's not one of the more important aspects. You know, it'll have a hard time locking, which can have multiple factors. That doesn't have to do with the app, can do with your surroundings, can do with a lot of things. 
But I loved Wii Sports Resort as a kid. So it's really cool to see, I mean, not Wii Sports Resort, I loved, I got a Wii, and I loved Wii Sports, you know, the whole interaction of play it around and stuff like that, and I could totally see this taking that kind of pattern, oh, that was a bad one, just went off into infinity, and so it's really cool to see something taking advantage of, you know, the actual space, the sports, I mean, I could see someone playing, I could see you playing tennis back and forth with friends, you know, lots of different things, you taking points with Fred's. I mean, uh, this wouldn't work as good in a smaller space, so that might be a struggle for some people, but you could go outside, you could do it in a gymnasium, you could do it anywhere. It's a pretty cool idea. It's nice to see an app take advantage of bigger rooms such as this. I'm not quite at the end. I've been, I've basically maxed out what a room, and this is a pretty big room for most standards. So... But I'm not going to bore you guys with the rest of the game, so I'll go ahead and I'll fast forward it through this probably. And yeah, I'll check back after it's done. So it checks back, it looks like I got about 107. You know, that's a little bit higher than what I normally get because I'm pretty bad at bowling. But, uh, you know, this is this is pretty cool. It takes advantage of, you know, full spatial awareness. This is a cool app, a cool idea. Worth checking out for sure, especially if you have kids. I could see this one being a really fun one for kids to go ahead and, uh, you know, you just give them it to them and they can play this forever. I mean, if I was a kid, I gotta have fun placing this down and doing something like this. It's just a beta. Well, I mean, it's a full release, but this is just the initial release. So, um, it's cool to see something like this and I can totally see lots of improvements to be made and lots of different features to be added, like multiplayer or different, lots of different things. You know, maybe a little bit, um, a better way to figure out to do it for smaller spaces because not a lot of people are going to have access to big rooms like this. Thanks for watching this video of our app preview of Hollow Bowl. It's a pretty cool app. Go ahead and check it out if you guys have a Hollow Lens or check it out in the App Store if you don't. I don't think it's quite available for everything yet, but it'll be there pretty soon. Uh, we're going to hopefully put out a couple more videos this week. Um, and thanks for all your guys' incredible support. Thanks for watching all our videos, thanks for liking, commenting, subscribing. We actually are almost done with our website, so every intro says theholoherald.com, but it's not been up yet. I've just been looking for a job, working on it, on the side and that kind of stuff, but it's almost up. You can expect that soon. You guys can go check it out, Book, bookmark theholoherald.com, check it out. It's just a, temp, just a little holder template thing now, not a big deal, but... Hopefully we'll be there soon so you can get all your news source and you can join the community forums. Hopefully we'll have all that fun stuff up for the holographic mixed reality, you know, augmented reality stuff for, so we can actually have a real community. Um, so thanks for checking it out. Thanks for all the support again and we'll catch you in the next video.